Get the SOFP after unboxing one remote control, multi purpose remote control. So it comes with the air mouse function. And then you can connect to your Android TV box and then your TV as well. And then it comes with the keyboard. So for me, it's considered 4 in 1. So remote control, so TV, Android box, and then um, the air mouse and the keyboard. So 4 in 1. So um, today I demonstrate how to connect the TV to your multi purpose. Uh, uh, remote control so basically uh, after I review the menu and then how the thing set up and function and now is the video I show you how to uh, set the multi-purpose remote control so first thing you have to install the battery so battery is here so I'm not going to open up same as other remote control okay so this is my Android box this is my TV and this is the new remote control so first thing all the control, you have to install the battery in order to send out the signal. So the new remote control, it doesn't work automatically when you first uh, plug into your TV or Android box. There's a small receiver, I already plug into my Android box USB slot. So then, uh, some of the button is function, but of course, you want to turn on the TV or you want to turn on your Android box. I'm not too sure you can remote control your fan, your aircon, all these things. Yeah. So, First thing, you have to know how to set up before you can um, set all your uh, function button. Yeah, first thing, you have to press and hold the TV button. So you can see, when you press and hold, it's fast, press, fast flashing. So after you release, then the remote control is ready to receive any signal. So for example, I press the TV, TV power button. So after press, then you will hold, which is, you receive the signal and you choose the button you want to turn on the TV for example I choose the power button for the multi-purpose remote after I click then you will flash slowly so after I click to confirm you press again the TV then it will turn off the flashing okay now the button is done up the setup so the rest of the button is the same which is you press and hold for TV button okay so after fast flashing and you re release your, your button and you press Okay, this is my Android box, and I prefer the blue button to my Android box power button. So I press, then you will press slowly again to confirm TV button again. Okay, done. So this is my TV power button, and this is my Android box power button. So of course I have set up um, all these four, and I'm not too sure the rest of it can set to this uh, uh, other function or this thing. Like I want to click. The volume to TV or to Android box, something like that. So you can try. And then where I purchased this Android box, you can screenshot and where this product from is from China. So the function, everything. Okay, uh -huh. And this is where the model. Yeah. So where I purchased this item from Lazada. So thank you for watching. And then the next click is how I show you after I set up and remote control uh, my TV and Android box. Thank you for watching. Please give a thumbs up if you like it and subscribe my video. Thank you. Have a nice day.